pipe drive tutorial for beginners so the first thing that i want you guys to do is come over to pipedrive.com you just simply google it and it'll click on the first site that appears so once you click on it the website will look something like this and over here you just simply have to click on the sign up button but before that let me just tell you a little bit about pipe drive so you might have used other crm software such as hubspot but unlike hubspot this is very very easy to use it is simple that is basically what makes pipe drive different is its simplicity its ease of access and it's easy to use so having said that let's just sign up onto this website so to sign up you just simply have to click on get started over here at the bottom or click on get started button at the top left corner over here so whichever one you choose doesn't really matter basically gives you the same access so simply click on get started and over here you just simply have to enter in your email and then just simply click on continue or you can access quickly with either google or linkedin account either way it is fine so i'm gonna go ahead and click on google because that way you don't have to enter in all the details manually you just simply click on one button and you'll be able to sign in and sign up onto any website so i'm gonna go ahead and click on google now over here once you signed up they will ask you some questions to get you started so just enter in your name and your company name and then if you have a promo code simply click on choose this option if you have a promo code but if you don't it doesn't really matter so if you have a promo code you can go ahead and enter that promo code over here and then just simply click on continue and if you want to receive occasional sales tips from pipe drive simply check this box or leave it unchecked it doesn't really affect your sign up process so i entered in all the details and clicked on continue now they're asking you how many people are in your company that will use pipe drive so i'm gonna say one to five and then all you have to do is choose the company industry so let's just say that our company falls into creative agency where web designing advertising and creating videos and whatnot fall into so then they're going to ask you what is your experience with sales tools to simply enter in or just choose whatever options you're comfortable with i'm going to choose this one over here and then just simply click on start using pipe drive give it a few seconds to create your account and once it's loaded up now once the website is loaded up this is how it will look like so as you can see we have a lot of things going on over here so let me just go ahead and go over them briefly so that you get a general idea of what i'm talking about so the main page that we're on right now is called the deals now over here you can create deals and then you can add in different options and proposals and all the other details but before we do get into deals let's just go ahead and go over these options right here on the left column over here so at the top we have leads now leads will basically help you to track and find deals of your competitors so that you can make better deals and get more customers over onto your platform and then down below we have deals once you have find leads you will have to create a better deal than your competition and over here you can do so and i will be telling you that how you can create a deal in just a moment and then down below you will have mails now over here you will be able to read emails and create emails compose emails send emails basically do everything that you normally do with an email provider but pipe drive has its own services so that you don't have to switch between different apps and that you can you simply use this email over here that they provide next you will have activity now activity will be basically if you have added your team members or have a to-do list or stuff like that you're basically going to need activity and over here you can create your own activity you can also connect your own google calendar to pipe drive to see all your activities in one place and then down below you will have contacts now, over here you can basically you can add people that are going to be your contacts or people that you are going to work with and you can also add an organization and stuff like that and down below you will have insight now over here basically this is the analytics section of pipe drives and this is the dashboards here you will see all the different reports that you can you'll see deals started deal lost deals won over time you will have a complete activity and record of emails sent average values deal durations deal conversions and mass product souls and many many more and then down below you will have products here you will be able to add or create new products that you are going to be selling and that are going to be a part of your super amazing deal and then you have nine more options but those aren't really really necessary they are just for advanced users they aren't really for beginners because once you get a hang of this website you'll be automatically be able to use them and it will be like your instincts while driving a car 
because when you're driving a car when an experienced driver is driving a car he doesn't look at everything it he uses his instincts he just knows when to shift his gear when to hit the brakes when to look at the mirror and stuff like that these are going to be those options when you get a hang of this website these are going to become your instincts so let's just go ahead and get on with the video so the first thing that i want you guys to do is create a contact so click on contact and over here you're going to add in persons so when you're adding a person simply click on the person button over here and over here you just simply add in your name the organization he belongs to the labels the phone numbers the email address and stuff like that so go ahead and fill out this form so i'm going to write in lee and over here he belongs to the ano productions now another Another thing that you can do is and over here you can basically choose the labels if he is a customer is he a hot lead a warm lead or a cold lead let's just say that he's a customer simply add in the phone number and then an email address and then just simply click on save now you have a customer now you have a person over here and then down below the people sections you will have organizations now over here you can also add in different organizations as i told you before we added our one of our customers into the ano productions the organizations has been added into our organization list now what we need is products so now we have a customer let's create a product and then we'll be able to create different deals so come over to the product sections and over here click on create a new product now over here write the name of that product enter in the product code select the category select the unit and select the unit price and then just simply click on save so let's just say that we're selling a artificial plant and the product code is two and now select the category and the category it belongs to is home decor simply click on new and then now let's just say it goes for 0.5 kg half a kilo and then add in the unit price and let's just say it goes for around 500 pakistani rupees now you can add in more basically you can add more prices for different countries you can add in prices for the united states or china or afghanistan or whatever country you want you can simply add in those prices and then down below you will have taxes you can add in the percentage of tax let's just say that 10 percent is the tax fee and then just simply click on save now we have a customer now we have a product let's just go ahead try to sell this product so go ahead on deals now over here you can create a new deal or if you have a deal set up and you want to import that data simply click on import data and you can upload the file onto pipe drive on that is saved on your computer or laptop or smartphone or whichever device you use so go ahead and click on qualified so over here enter in the contact person let's just say it is this person right here and he also belongs to the a and o organizations now over here and let's just say that it belongs to the small wood organizations and now over here you will be able to add in the title of that deal and then you can add in the value let's just say the value will be going around for 1000 and then down below you will have pipeline stage so over here you have qualified you will have contact made you'll have demo schedules then you will have proposals made and then you will have negotiation standards and then down below you can add expected date to close and then over here you can add in person such as the phone number or the email address and the product item let's just say that product number two and quantity is one click on save now this was the deal we can move that deal over to contact made and once you have made contact with the deal and you're talking with the person who is trying to make that deal then you can just move it over to demo schedule where you can basically show the buyer or the person you are dealing with a small demo and then you will over here you will be able to make a proposal and over here it will determine whether or not your deal is started then once you have made a proposal simply click on negotiation started and now you have completed the deal now basically you can track if you want the deal let's just say that the person liked the deal and you can click on one now you simply won the deal and that was your first deal so as you can see we have made contact so that is how you basically create deals and stuff like that and over here you can basically add in different notes different activities proposal time call email files basically all the things that you wanted to keep a track of of about this deal so that you can better 
yourself for the next deal that you're going to make and try to better yourself as you go along with this process and over here you will have a revenue basically you will have to choose a billing plan you can either choose a subscription plan or a payment schedule whichever one you choose depends upon your style so that is basically it guys i've shown you everything that you needed to know about pipe drive and if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like button subscribe to our channel and turn on post notification guys and i forgot to ask that if you guys have any questions related to this website please let me know in the comment sections down below and i will be sure to get back to them as soon as possible and having said that i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye